Did you know that the UK construction industry creates about 100 million tonnes of waste each year? If we put all that in a pile, it would be taller than the Shard, the highest building in Europe. That makes it the UK's biggest contributor to waste generation and dwarfs the amount of household waste. Nowadays, almost 90% of construction and demolition waste is diverted away from landfill, which is good progress, and a large proportion of this is recycled. But is recycling really the answer? We tend to think of it as a neat process in which new products emerge, just the same as the original. That's closed-loop recycling. But most of the time, the new product is less good and doesn't capitalise on the usefulness of the original. Like making chipboard from timber. That's open-loop recycling, or downcycling. How can we make better use of our materials? Recycling involves a lot of transportation and processing. Can we find ways to shortcut all of that and directly reuse materials? Existing buildings contain a wealth of useful materials, but when they're demolished, it turns to waste. If we collect information about these materials early enough and share it online, we could create a system to connect materials with people who can use them. But how would we collect all that data? When a developer plans to strip out or demolish a building, they could draw up a materials menu by rating the materials and components according to their quantity, condition, and where and when they'll become available. This could be submitted along with all the other planning permission documents, and the data could be combined to make an interactive map of available materials. People would be able to search for things they need and agree on a deal. Materials no longer become waste, and contractors' disposal costs are reduced. Think of all the different architects and designers, with all their creativity. If they had access to a materials map like this, then they could come up with all kinds of new ways to use old stuff. A market for reuse would soon start to develop. It's not just about one building. It's about seeing beyond waste and improving the whole way we go about regenerating our cities. In an era of rapid digitalization of almost all aspects of life, it's time to apply the technology at our fingertips to make construction more resourceful. It's time to make more effective use of all the resources in our world.